everyone, I'm Shaylin with Readsy, and today I'm here with the last video in the series on book marketing. So far, we've talked about finding your target audience, perfecting your brand, and some social media marketing strategies. Today, we're going to expand on a few ideas in the last video and talk about cross-promotion. First of all is to join forces with other authors who have similar target audiences. If you join forces with two other authors, you can triple the size of your target audience. In doing so, you can also organize takeovers on each other's social media platform. You can send newsletters about each other's work during launches, or organize things like giveaways or contests on each other's social media platforms. You can also try doing a giveaway together. Work with other authors to do a bundle giveaway on Goodreads. Another great strategy is to run promotions. In order to gain more reviews and hopefully increase your reader base, you can run a promotion where you set your book to a discounted price. And then, in order to promote your promotion, you can look at sites like BookBub or Bargain Booksy, which are focused on connecting readers to book promotions. You can also cross-promote your new release with your backlist. If you have a backlist, you can run promotions on those books and include links to your new release. This allows you to run a promotion that gains your readers for both books without lowering the price of your new release. Another strategy is to search for media opportunities. This is often easier for non-fiction authors, but even if you're writing fiction, you can probably find blogs that are interested in hearing your writing and publishing story. Another place to look would be podcasts. Podcasts are so common these days, which means there are tons of podcasts out there looking for people to interview. You can also write up a press release and contact the producers at your local TV and radio station. Another strategy would be to organize readings and book signings at local bookstores. You can also involve other authors to try and pool your audiences. Contact your local bookstores and see if you can organize a reading if you write fiction or poetry, or do a talk if you write nonfiction. And finally, try to get your book into library. Make sure your book is available through a wholesaler, then contact your library and make a case for why they should stock it. Reezy has a free course on getting your book into libraries if you'd like to learn more, and I'll leave a link to that in the description. So that wraps up this series on book marketing. If you want to revisit any of the points in all of these videos, you can check out the blog post linked in the description, and remember to subscribe for new videos every Tuesday and Friday. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time.